Kia ora, my name is Rui and my mate Andy and I, we run and operate a social enterprise in the heart of Mount Roskill called Critical Pixels Design. Um, so our community, Roskill, Wesley, Roskill South, uh, the last of social housing forts in an increasingly gentrifying neighbourhood in central Auckland. Um, our, what's also really unique about our context or our community is um, like we are the second most culturally diverse suburb in the whole world per capita. Um, our neighbourhood is the convergence of Somali refugees, um, immigrants, Islamic families, Polynesians, um, Māori, Chinese, Asian and although through statistics New Zealand there is um, a huge a lot of focus on deprivation um, from our experience living and working in this community is that actually this neighbourhood has so much to offer. The amount of creative capacity and creative capital our neighbours offer is what the rest of Auckland and New Zealand needs to thrive. Now the existing system doesn't cater for that and so our social enterprise or our purpose we simply ask ourselves is that how might we um, uncover creative leaders, uncover and cultivate creative leaders through design thinking and open source technologies. Um, so a big part of how we go about what we do um, is developing empathy um, in the young people and in just community uh, members in general. Um, so we use a design thinking process and that engages them uh, not only with what they think but um, it allows them to get rid of their own assumptions and to take, you know, take on someone else's perspective of an issue. And then with exchange, it's um, not keeping that idea to myself, it's sharing it, it's contributing, um, again, not just to our community, but maybe to other communities that are facing the same problem. So our social impact are in direct reflection of the needs in this community. One of our dreams is that if in the future there is a new development happening in our community, whether if it's um, community centre, public space or social housing, um, we hope that eventually our neighbours can come together and we can set up hubs which our community can come, design, assess where the needs are in their community um, and essentially develop and build that house, that community centre, that park bench. So I guess like we would measure that um, based I guess on you know how the project goes. Um, so you know if we come up with a successful design and you know through building empathy with our end users you know taking the community through that process um, it's almost certain that the end product will be something that everyone wants and needs.